Uh, hello everyone. So in this video, I'm just doing an unboxing of a nice oscilloscope, or a Chinese one that is. So this is called the FNIR C. I guess that's what that's how it's spelled. So all these Chinese names are weird. Have on the side here. This is the FNIR C. 101 3D, the Shenzhen FNIR C technology company. All right, let's try and open the box. So, uh, yeah, now the box we have a manual here for the construction. I believe they have some problems with the spelling here. They say two channel plate or scope. Okay, <laughs> whatever. Uh, let me see what they say here. It doesn't say anything there. <laughs> Anyways, we have here some probes and some accessories. Uh, plus a user guide for the probes. Uh, okay, there are two probes here, an adjustment screwdriver, and some uh, rings to determine which it which is which. Charles, I'm not sure what these caps are for here. So yeah, that's that. We also get in the box a regular charger. Uh, this is five volts. So that's a two amp five volt or adapter. We get a type C to type A cable and the oscilloscope itself. So in the pictures, it looked a bit bigger. I uh, got nothing on these sides, but on the top here, you got the power button, USB-C input, some LEDs for, I guess, for charging in the state. So that channel two here, channel one, and then output of a one kilohertz, yeah, one kilohertz signal, and it has on the back. Oh, the holes for the screws plus this stand here it's a flimsy one so in order to ensure like it's sitting properly you need to fold it all the way back it doesn't have like degrees of uh, or angles of that it stays in it, has, it comes with a protective film here that we will peel off later we just turn it on real quick, so we push the red power button, there you go. And that's you got, you got your interface there. So, I believe you touch here to change the time division, you can see it right over there. And for the vertical divisions, I believe you click on control. And then you can see it change over there. Now we don't have any signal to really show what's going on, but yeah, you have the auto set button. Let's set everything for you. There is a menu here. There's the USB connection to connect to the computer. Not sure if you can update the firmware or not. And yeah, I'm gonna check this in more depth uh, video and show the functionalities and the controls uh, that's pretty much it here is the charging status bar mm, that's pretty much it